Hi guys, I just wanted to come on here and answer some questions I've been getting about my Campaign for a Life profile. Uh, I had put in there that the proudest moment of my life was walking after a double neurosurgery and I instantly got all these messages asking, what in the world? Are you okay? What happened? And so I just wanted to fill in some of the details for you. Um, this time last year, I was in an unbelievable amount of pain and was losing sensation in my legs. I mean, even to the point where I would get out of bed and fall flat on my face. And uh, I knew this wasn't just a little backache. So I spent a couple months going to doctors trying to figure out what it could be. And I um, went into a doctor's office right after Christmas and he did an MRI on my spine and found that I had a tumor growing inside my spinal cord. Um, he referred me to a brain surgeon who told me that surgery was my only option and that if I didn't have surgery within a year, I would be paralyzed. So, I mean, you know, needless to say, two weeks later, I found myself on an operating table facing this very delicate spinal procedure. And the first um, operation was successful in that he was able to remove the tumor completely, but then my spinal cord was still leaking um, spinal fluid outside of the seven inch incision in my back. And so he had to go back in and try to stop that leak. As part of that regimen, I had to lay in bed um, for two weeks after that to try to keep all the pressure off of that incision. Um, so I finally, you know, got up after two weeks. I think I walked about five steps, you know, with people holding me up, but there was no better feeling in the world. And I think I actually used a walker for about three to four weeks after that. I just feel really blessed to live in these times. You know, I think even a hundred years ago, I would have gone paralyzed and not even known or understood why. And things like this just really focus my perspective, you know, on honoring God and living and loving each crazy day like it's my last. Um, right now, I'm doing well, I'm getting stronger and I only have minor restrictions left. Um, one of those is I'm completely restricted from doing a sit-up, so it's kind of a great excuse not to have to exercise. Um, but for those of you who are wondering what happened, that is my scary spinal surgery story.